we have to give them the privacy policy. Some students don't want to log into tools that um, are going to share all their information with everybody else that you know has products to give. Um, if we provide them with the policy, um, privacy policies right up front, they can decide whether they want to use that tool or if they want to find a different tool to use that maintains their privacy as students. When I've given them different websites that they can go that have tools on them, um, I provide a link right in with that tool information as to what their privacy policies are. I provide the link right to their website so that they can read them and make the decision as to whether they want to use that tool or not. One of the pitfalls that um, faculty and students can run into uh, when privacy policies are something that a student doesn't want to use because they're uncomfortable with the privacy policies of uh, the software that were chosen to use is that the, um, we can find another way around that assignment for that student to still meet the course requirements and um, be able to complete the assignment in their comfort zone. Not being able to come up with another way for them to complete that assignment if they refuse to use one of the tools. Um, I mean, it's unlikely that we wouldn't be able to find something to use, but um, I guess once it happens once, we'll have that tool ready, okay, try this one. Thank you.